What's the box I need? Uh, oh wow, have we cleared ourselves out of um, steel beams? Of what? Uh, steel beams. We, we ran, our, ran ourselves out of steel beams. No, I just ran us out of steel beams. Oh, okay. That's annoying, but we can fix that. A minute here. We should have any plenty of encased still, though. You know, you missed the trick there. Um, keep making all the motors, because I'm going to need a thousand of the motors. Okay. Oh, well, yeah, it's still running. It's just, it was backed up entirely, so they're now just started up again. So you missed the trick. You should have said to beam me up. Ugh. Ugh, jeez. Beam me up, Steely. I caught it. I just didn't want to say anything. Yeah. We also might want to put a, uh, put a storage container on the circuit boards. Because we need circuit boards separately for another piece as well. Yeah, that's why we're getting the. Um, I want to get this quartz up because that'll help. Because with Griff pulling in steel, well, what iron for steel, and that steel manufacturer, and I'm about to pull in quartz, that'll make yeah. us circuit boards at probably a fair whack. Uh, let's have a look. Circuit boards, alternative recipe. 12, yeah, so 12 and a half a minute per manufacturer. But needs copper in. Ooh, it's gonna be more fun. Um, do you have any modular frames in the mall? I can't remember if I put any in here. Not in the mall, but there's some in the uh, box that goes up to the heavy modular frames. That's where I was pulling them from. Ah, it's empty at the moment. <laughs> I need 20. Uh, that's 14, so that's 15. I have exactly 20. <laughs> I'll just take the lot. There we go. Uh, cable steel beam is the bit that I'm currently stuck on. Cable's easy. Uh, two stacks of cable. Uh huh. So four portable miner and 600 steel beams. And that's only a guess because it's for um, railway track. steel beam at all. We had some on here, didn't we? Ah, we're completely out. Well, that's some... There's back to back mod. So Three hundred. Right, that'll do for a little bit. Probably I can always come back.
You, me both. Down here. I tell you what, where's all that coal going right now? Which coal? How did, uh, the one that was going to the generator. Uh, it's just stopped in midair. Hard drive we got has bio coal, rubber concrete, or rubber. Bio coal? Yeah, uh, it turns biomass into coal. You don't really need that right now. And it's not really sustainable for long term steel production. What were the other ones? Rubber coal, which is nine wire and six rubber to make 20 at 100 per minute, or concrete, which is. 10 limestone, 2 rubber, for 9 concrete at 45 per- Can we the second one again? Uh, rubber cable, 9 wire, 6 rubber, makes 20 cable, at a rate of 100 cable per minute. Oh yeah, I can see it now too. Ah. Um. Gotta be honest, these are all pretty crappy. Yeah, I'm not entirely yeah. enthused by any of those. No, they're my... Of all of them, the... That's wire, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, and we're doing plenty of the uh, the wire with the Caterium. Yeah. Then we'd have to get rubber for the cable as well. And frankly, like, yeah, we can make the cable a lot faster, but we're making it fast enough as it is, so it's not really that... I don't know, I feel like the bio coal is probably the least harmful option there. I can't think of either of those that I really want to put rubber to because we need. First of all, we need plastic out of the wazoo, which means we would be taken away from plastic production. Okay, so it's, I'll just select the bio coal. I would go with the bio coal, and then we'll probably just never use it, honestly. Okay. Do we have another hard drive to put in? Uh, no. That was my last one. Uh, there was two over by the way you were going, and I've I've spotted two. I just can't get to them yet. One of them's in gas, and one of them is um down off the one of the cliffs it's like over there oh there's the coal okay how much is going out here that way can very belt mark for you <laughs> we're gonna need more coal Do you want to have my uh, that factory's gonna use more than I got here Does coal go into... Actually, can you use liquid biofuel in the jetpacks? I can't remember if you said... Uh... I don't believe so, no. Damn. <sighs> I have to get some more biofuel at some point. More fuel. Hello, spitters! Somebody might want to be whapped? Whappity whap. How much coal are we getting to this? Is this a pure node? It is! It's a pure node! Okay. So I can just upgrade this right now and overclock it. I'm we'll snap to a foundation. I don't killed by the spitter!
Oh my god, there's another one. And flies. And another spitter. And pigs. Good lord. Mm. That's tall enough yet, but <laughs> there was a power slug hiding under a uh, coal rock. Sneaky little bastards. Right, to the next stage of the railway. Four or five of Okay, I'm gonna come get some more biofuel, some more packaged fuel, so I can actually uh, do this last bit of the railway. <laughs> We upgrade them all entirely to tier four um, belts. I can't remember. I don't think so. Might be 
an idea to do that at some point. Canisters, we've got four canisters in there. Uh, well, yeah, steel beams are a real bottleneck for the upgrade as of right now. Okay. I mean, I've got three. I know I've got three hundred steel beams on me, but as soon as I finish this railway, no, that'll it'll go through those. And this thing needs thirty steel beams per minute. Wow. Yeah. When Griff finishes Each. the uh, steel oh, input, then that's going to be a bit better. Oh, I tracked too long. Right, I need to put a plane in the middle. <sighs> yep. That was annoying because I just managed to make the uh, platform high enough. <laughs> Didn't realize that the railway track had a uh, maximum length per section. That's how they get you. Well, it was a learning experience at least. Explains a lot. Our foundries are bottlenecking to us too. We're just because we're not putting enough steel out, right? Yeah, they're not putting out uh, 60. They're only putting out 40. Yeah, we're gonna have uh, quite a bit of steel coming through here shortly. Yeah, Griff's working on how many? Uh, it's 10, isn't it? I've got, well, I've got eight foundries set up here. I could do another two. Um, well, do no eight because it's better than now. And then we can we just need to actually like connect everything to it, and then it, they uh, they should be off. Power is kind of a problem here, actually, because I I didn't know where the hell to put the poles. But anyhow, uh, there's a pole my... um, near to the railway. No, 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 we're we're good. Like I got the power there. It's just it's hard to find like where I should actually be putting the power in the thing. Ah, okay. But seeing as how the power goes, you know, through stuff too, the cables, and I can just kind of put them wherever. Yeah. Now I just got to get the coal and the iron over there, so I'm going to need a bunch more in case. You know, we got a bunch of quartz over here in this one box right here. I just remembered I've got like 500 got quartz on me. Crap. Yeah, that'd be useful for the um... nuclear. Yeah.
actually start it. That tree dies. Oh crap, nope. I'll take that, that's a win. Who has the overclock pieces? Um, I think Griff's got most of them at the moment. No, I put them back in that thing in the uh, hub area. Okay. We'll try overclocking a little bit because everything is full of. I mean, there's a backlog of, if you need steel beams, there's a backlog of steel beams are upstairs for the, on the top floor for the, um, in case steel beam production for our own use. So that might be usable. Yeah, I'm just going to set these, um, these steels for... The foundries to where they need to be at 60 per minute. Okay. Because they're all full. Like, they are they all have 100 and 100 of, of everything. So. Too long again. Ah. Okay, we have coal. Now I gotta get another like 300 industrial beams and of the iron. are now fit. Excellent. Now where's these encasement segments we're talking about? Top floor. So we got a just above somewhere. all the steel production. There's um there's some more basically there's a two steel on the end that go up. Ah, um, fair. Found it. Like 600 uh, encased steel beams in there. Did I get about 300? You can take all the encased you want. I don't need ink. Yeah, but the back. But I that, need standard. Yeah, that one I know is backlogged. Ah, oh, poop. Right, I just gotta figure out where the hell I put that iron and then bring it on over. Deaths to gravity. That's like yep. five now so far. <laughs> gravity has always been humanity's greatest downfall. It's good seeing all the tier 4 belts starting to come into the base though. Alright, I've removed all 300 from that. Right. 
Ah, oh, crap, I just thought, where I just died is really difficult to get to. Okay. It would have been easier to go that way, but never mind. Bring out your iron. Any old iron. Bring out your grass. And that is, yeah. No wonder I didn't survive the fall. That's a long way down. It's that'll do it. Yeah. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen large foundations <laughs> fall, <laughs> and the large foundation is. All right, we're gonna be putting out about three hundred and sixty steel a minute here. Let me just talk. With these eight That's foundries. all. Well, I could add another two on to the end, no problem. But I ran out of room. Hey, look, I died have again. We brought, have we brought quartz in yet? No, that's what I'm working on right now. Shark the second is part way. If this setup works out okay, there's absolutely no reason we can't just toss in like another two foundries on the end, and because uh, that's as much as the tier four is going to carry. But 360 steel a minute right now. That is really nice and neat. I like that. Yeah, like I said, this is based off that one video that somebody linked. I don't remember whose, but uh... so it's so it's in on, in on the uh, outside and out on the middle. Is it? Yeah, uh, the middle you can. It's actually it's going towards the uh, other end, away from the inputs, just so we can keep it, you know, relatively in, in and out. That's okay. That is that off, is but... that is a brilliant use of the new mo new blocks. Yeah, I can't I can't claim credit for it. I thought it was a really good idea though. Yeah, that's that's awesome, and it makes that really neat. Got a little bit of spaghetti getting in here, but yeah, it's it's nice yeah. and modular. You can just kind of keep stacking it up as much as you need. Yeah. I mean, hell, if you get it right, you can probably make use the um, the open frames at the top, and then you could stack it, you and could. then stack, then do two open frames and then another platform, then stack it that yeah, way if you want it. And that way, it's not like you you don't you then don't have. Um, the splitters just hanging in midair. I actually uh, stacked up. They fixed a the thing where you can pay it, uh, so you can put splitters on other splitters now. Ah, uh, uh, they fixed that one. Crashing. Thank yeah. Christ. <laughs> Although actually, I like the way we got we did it on the other bit, but yeah. Oop. Oh. I had anything on me on the second deck. No. I actually probably could have brought these splitters up another level, but whatever. Yeah, the thing was, I wasn't sure where the clearance was to get the vertical over the uh, foundries, so they just kind of ended up here. Right. I think that I could actually get this even more closer together, if I had to. We could shave even more space off the sides. Yeah, I don't. I, I think space is not really an issue right now. The other thing that occurred to me is that uh, if I had some way of like separating out the belts and stuff, I could actually do a dual feed, uh, dual feed at the bottom, so I could have the iron and the coal going in through here. I would never put unless you're going into a box just for random storage and then or, uh, and then sorting. I would never put dual things on one belt because if any, no, anything no, 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 no. backs not, up, not the dual on one belt. 